problem with this junction is the fact it's so wide. Because it's wide, traffic doesn't need to slow down to enter it. So if they're coming down the hill up the road at 30 to 40 miles an hour, they can just turn into the junction and not slow down. Anyone crossing the road just doesn't get a chance. It's such a long walk that you're out there exposed all the time. A cycling perspective, I view this junction is very busy and quite fast, so something I take quite um, care of. Um, I'm very careful to look for a safe gap in the, um, the traffic. But being a very busy junction, that can sometimes be difficult. If I was cycling here with children, I'd get them dismount crossing the zebra crossing. Now, this estate wasn't designed for cars, it was designed as a nice open plan sort of living area. As more and more cars come along, you know, they're all parked up down the sides of the roads, things will start to get tighter. And if people are not um, taking care of what they're doing, then uh, there can be problems. And when you've got that school coming out and there's a load of them, there's not a lot of space to stand. Mm. So, and I do tell him, stay in the middle, because mm. it's like two way traffic, isn't it? Very dangerous. The local, if you have to got this uh, idea called decision makers, has to listen locally rather than you know who is not living around this area. So, as a business operator you know, in this area for nine years, I know what's going on at least on the daytime. Yeah, so it makes sense for you, all your ideas and comments to be that's involved. Right. That's yeah, right. exactly. And um, you're, you kindly said that you're going to be um, building. Um, a planter too? Yeah, that's why I said to you, I'm going to living out of this area, so I have to give something back, so which I don't mind to pay uh, for the plant base and looking after it. Um, in my, you know, I have pleasure to do that. Yeah, and you've got all your lovely flowers. I uh, you know, that's mm -hmm. uh, as you know, means uh, we have to develop this area, you can see more. Uh, luckily, we don't have much graffiti at the moment, but we used to have lots of graffiti around this area. Uh, we have to make it more people friendly area. Yeah! I run the WFC at Baking Tree, Dagenham. My name is Ozzy and when we had this conversation before I thought it was not going to happen but now it did which is really good. I mean everyone tried to do something. Before there was nothing like that but now we see process going on. When we see something, someone try to do something about it then the society all become like one voice and try to say, yeah, let's do it, let's do it, but unless we need someone like you, so...